Hello, hello, and welcome to the Maasai Mara. There is a gorgeous member of the Angama Pride of Lions who are fast becoming one of my favorite prides in this part of the world. My name is Brent, and I've got Viem on his first drive in the Maasai Mara. Isn't this incredible? And, I mean, it's the middle of the day, and we've got lions, lions all around. So we've, oh, we can't see the second lioness now. She's just moved a little bit. We've already found a big male. We found all seven cubs and now two lionesses, all within the space of a couple of hundred meters. Now, what I am hoping is that those lionesses are going to move towards where the male is. He's sleeping probably about 200 meters uh, to the west of us here. Uh, under a shepherd's tree but these girls one of them is quite hungry and she's the one who's walked off and the other is quite fat and she's the one who's sitting there so they must have caught something and uh, not too big or maybe caught and not shared and now of course we're still missing quite a few other adult lionesses from the pride and I've been keeping a careful lookout around <coughs> oh, excuse me to where they might be. Now, as you know, prides do split from time to time, and it seems to be far more common uh, with the lions in this area that they go into twos and threes. Of course, I think when the, the migration arrives, that is going to change considerably. But this isn't this exciting. Lions out in the open, on the move, in Kenya. I can't wait to hear from you. Send your feeds. Now, we're in the Mara Triangle Reserve, which is on the western side of the Mara River. And there are lots and lots of lions. Isn't that exciting? So this is the Angama Pride. And they literally live directly below where the new final control is going to be in our camp. And then a little bit further to the south, you've got the Mogoro Pride. And then you've got the Serena Pride. Then you've got the Egyptian Goose Pride. Then you've got the Border Pride down on the Tanzanian border. And then you have... The oh, I forgot the bridge pride, and then you also have the sausage pride. It's a lot of prides now. The Angama pride, oh, she's off, and that's the fatty one you can see. And they are heading towards where the male is, so we might just move up ahead. Now, the fatty one, so oh, I nearly forgot that Angama pride are actually a breakaway pride from the world famous marsh pride that lived just on the other side of the Mara River. So they have marsh pride, they were marsh pride and they've now taken over from the Olololo pride, who's also probably a breakaway from the marsh pride. So there's four lionesses um, that form the main Angama pride. There's also another three lionesses further to the north that will join with them. Okay, so, and a very exciting thing today, and before we get on to that, Robin in Australia says, I love the Mara. Me too, Robin. It makes me smile from ear to ear. We are in our very own Chiku, um, which is finally out of the workshop and seems to be running like a dream. So... The one thing about that is, uh, you're not going to be able to see me when I drive, so don't be surprised. VM is going to have to uh, show you the beautiful scenery while I try to keep up with the lions. So it's almost like I'm going to be going down the hatch. Toodles. Okay. Um, okay, well, we're going to try to catch up with these lions. And uh, let me just pop my head up again. Uh, hi, <laughs> while we do that, we're going to say goodbye, but we'll be seeing you later uh, on Safari Live. <laughs> 